Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be using this single stage uh, speaker amplifier to make a test probe so that you can test your amplifiers. Um, this amplifier is working, you can see I just connected to my phone here and, and it has a volume control so we can amplify signals so that's very important and I'll also be making it so it will only amplify audio sounds, it will not amplify DC voltage so I have some test probes here and I have an audio jack and I will be connecting my test probes to this audio jack um, so we have to find out what side this is because my amplifier is only using one side you can see when I connect the jack in there I'm only using the bottom channel so I'll be connecting my leads to that so here I have the uh, ground is the bottom clip there to the left and the yellow clip is the signal and so that will amplify my uh, sound so I'm going to be making a high pass filter just using a capacitor and resistor there you can see the signal will go through the capacitor but it will uh, the DC voltage will be blocked so here's how I have it connected I have the resistor connected to ground and my capacitor here you can see uh, when I connect to that lead of the capacitor it passes the audio signal but if I connect a uh, DC voltage it will stop uh, the DC voltage from going to uh, my speakers. So just soldering on my test probe there, the positive one, I'm going to the input of the capacitor. This will allow the signal to pass through, but it will block the DC voltage. And then the negative lead, I will connect to the ground. So this is how I have it soldered there. And that resistor combination I made it a high pass filter that will only pass about 15, any frequency above 15 uh, hertz. And so just typing it up. So this will connect to my amplifier for my test probe leads. So here we have it connected to my amp and let's have a try here. You can see it is amplifying the audio sound there. You'll notice that if I press the probes on my finger, it makes it also amplified some noise there because your skin also has AC voltage. Look at that on the scope there. You can see the AC voltage, so it amplifies a little bit of sound. Now, if I put DC voltage, let's say five volts, and I try to amplify, you can see actually, or listen, it's not actually making any sound just because it's effectively blocking that voltage. But if I connect to an audio source or AC voltage, it will amplify it because that will be able to pass through that small capacitor that I put on my leads. This is very useful because if you're testing the amp, you want to trace out the, where the audio is and you don't want to blow up your speaker because let's say there's 20 D, uh, volts DC. If you connect that to your probe, you could really uh, make a loud squawk on your speaker and maybe damage your speakers. So these probes help you to just isolate for the AC sound. Look at that, just from using reused parts. Hope this video was helpful. Please like the video and subscribe.